You have a very interesting choice to make, douchebag. I know you'll make the right decision. Uh, fine! You're gonna be sorry, new kid! Get out of my way or I'll kick your ass! his desk. Victory is ours! Hey, wait a minute. Our desks don't have insides. What? Desks at this school just have tabletops. No, but, but Twitter said that... Look over here. This desk has writing on it. Check my locker. Whose desk is that? That's... That's Clyde's desk. Humans and drow elves of Zaron. Clyde, he took the stick. While you've all been busy fighting amongst yourselves, I have built a kingdom beyond your comprehension. I prayed for a way to destroy you all, and the solution came crashing down from the heavens. Oh no, it's more of that green stuff. With what I have found, I shall raise an army of the dead. I shall raise an entire army of darkness and kill the Earth! Clyde, but why? I banished him to be lost in space and time, and now he's all pissed off. So you see, fools, I control the stick and the future of the Earth! Clyde, do you want a sandwich? Not now, Dad. I'm making a Ruler of Darkness video. Whoever controls the stick controls the universe, and my first deed is that I hereby denounce the human and the elf kingdoms and strip both kings of all their power! <laughs> Motherfucker! Oh, hello, boys. Can we speak to Clyde, please? Oh, Clyde's out playing in the backyard with his little friends. Come and get it, losers! <laughs> you can't do that, Clyde! You're lost in time and space! No, I'm not! Yeah, you are, asshole! Army of Darkness, defend the fortress! Greg! Greg, you're on my side! You don't have authority anymore. The Keeper of the Stick said so. This can't be happening! God damn it! I have fucking authority! Sorry, warriors and wizards. I'd love to invite you into my Fortress of Darkness, but I'm afraid you're too late. Too late? What do you mean we're too late? There you are, butters. Do you know what time it is, mister? It is way past your bedtime. Oh, shit, it's past our bedtime? Dude, I'm gonna get it. <laughs> Clyde, it's past your bedtime. <laughs> okay, coming, Dad.
you are we've been looking all over for you do you know how late it is you are grounded now i want you to go to bed and think about what you've done Where's my normal hair? Do I have it? That's where that ends. Where is that? What's this? Oh. That's quite strong. But pretty cool. <laughs> Aha. Fishy. Guess that's it then. Off to bed. Good night, my little gumdrop. Hope you're enjoying all the peace and quiet in our new home as much as we are. Yeah. <laughs> Please, no aliens. Oh, she 
Yeah. Sometimes feel like we should tell him the truth. Why? So we can relive it all in his head? It's better that he can't remember. But if he really has this gift, he, he's going to discover it again on his own anyway. And then they'll try and use him for his gift and he'll become a weapon. They won't stop looking for him. We have to keep everything secret, even from him. I'm so frazzled. Will you just make love to me? Of course I will, darling. <sighs> <sighs>
foot. 